Hello friends, this is Cold Run. welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV Endwalker. Where we are here at Old Charlian, briefly, because I am 89 in my Dark Knight and I went to pick up the set here, the gear set, the Ignominy set it's called, and it looks fantastic! I am, I am feeling quite Cecilish. I am feeling quite early game Final Fantasy IV Cecilish. I, actually, now that I say that, I, I actually wonder if this, I know there's a lot of Final Fantasy IV themes in this game, and I wonder if this is actually modeled off his armor in that game, I and mean, the horns and everything. Anyway, let's go. Ah, so it's Gridania. I wasn't sure until I got here which, um, which place, which, whether it was, whether it would be Gridania or Lominza that gave me the tank quests, but it's Gridania. Shrouded in Peril. The Gridanian delegate is in urgent need of a stout defender to help combat a new threat to his homeland. Gridanian delegate. I have come on behalf of the Twin Adders to enlist the aid of, an accom of accomplished fighters. The small folk cower in their homes for fear of an unprecedented threat to the Twelves would. A blasphemy. It strikes quickly with deadly... I wonder what they're gonna... what this is gonna be about. Like, what's the main Twelve Wood conflict that's been going on? Is it the border it has with Al Amigo? Is it Beast Tribe stuff with the Sylphs? I don't know. I don't know Gridania that well. It strikes quickly and with deadly precision before returning to the shadows whence it came. Try as we might, we have yet to devise a means to track it, much less slay it. Several brave so I, I, I imagine the Lominso one will be something about piracy, but I don't know what. Like, peep, someone who is despairing because they can't be a pirate anymore, I don't know. Anyway, several brave souls search for it even now, but their chances would improve greatly if they had a stout protector by their side. Judging by your reputation, I dare say you are precisely the woman we seek. What say you? Will you serve as the shield that stands between Gridania and Certain Doom? I will stand as the two-handed sword that stands between Gridania and Certain Doom. Protecting the realm is what I do. I will take that as an enthusiastic yes. Make haste to the Adder's Nest and report to my superior. All Gridania shall pray for your success. Off to Gridania. Blasphemy Huntmaster, but first... Check out this amazing pink and black uh, style that this person has going on. Yana Dorden. What a great glam set that is. Blasphemy Hunter. Our liaison at Radzat Han sent word of your arrival, but I can still, still scarcely believe our luck. Are you truly here to help us bring this wicked blasphemy to heal? I mean, I'm here to bring the blasphemy to heal. We'll see if it's wicked or not. Then there is hope for us. I shall yet fet I shall fetch the Elder Seeds here at once. She is leading the hunt, and I'm certain she'll be most eager to see you. She's leading the hunt? I always thought of her as more of a behind-the-scenes character. Have we seen her really, like, unleash martial power? Maybe we have, I just don't remember. Kane Sena, full glad am I to welcome you in good health and good spirits, Kakushu. On behalf of all Gridania, allow me to thank you for rising to our defense yet again. You will forgive me for eschewing further formalities, as time is of the essence. I shall share with you what little we know of this elusive scourge. Following the events in Thavnair, we received a report that an unidentified man had fallen into fits on the road before transforming into a beast most foul, a blasphemy we soon determined. Eyewitnesses to subsequent attacks spoke of patterns on its skin reminiscent of heavy chains. Is it going to be like, um... No, never mind. I was going to say, is it going to be like anima style, like that sort of design? But they said patterns rather than... Rather than like actual chains. And thus we have renamed it Gleipnir for the creature of legend. I don't know Gleipnir, I know Sleipnir. It emerges from the brush without warning, bringing destruction and tragedy to those unfortunate enough to be near. Ere we can respond, it retreats into hiding, leaving no trace for us to follow. The elementals cry out for us to rid the forest of this wicked presence, yet even if we tracked it to its lair, I fear besting the beast would be no simple matter. Keeper of the Entwined Serpent. The wounds of Gleipnir's victims are tainted by corruption. We can but conclude that the fiend's fangs, claws, and horns are all imbued with a powerful poison. Uh-oh. 
The smallest scratch sends the afflicted into fits and death soon follows. So this one has a body count. Hane Sena. Mayhap you know of the creeping death. The effects of Gleipnir's vile poison bear more than a passing similarity to the symptoms of that deadly plague. Is that something that's come up in 14? I don't remember it. It swept through the... Oh, I guess they're telling us about it. It swept through the Twelveswood many years ago. The sick found their skin covered in chain-like patterns and spent their final moments in excruciating pain. Well, that answers my question of what kind of despair we're going to get. Or what kind of despair backstory we're going to get. Something related to that. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. It was long before I came to Gridania, but people still speak of it with dread. Is it true that the disease spared not a single Hure? Really? Wow. And it went just after Hure. Kane Sana. Very nearly, yes. Before the remainder were taken, we were able to devise a cure from the Glim Shroom. Slow though it was, the scars of this tragedy could then begin to heal. Gleipnir threatens to reopen old wounds, I fear. I actually, I wouldn't be surprised if this is something from 1.0. The fact that they mentioned this as something from years ago. Yet despite the similarities between the blasphemy's corruption and the creeping death's marks, it is unclear how these two phenomena are related, if at all. I can tell you that, I think. I mean, I could take a really good guess at it, at least. Both Conjury and White Magic have failed to abate the poison spread. To confront Gleipnir now would place our soldiers at risk of grievous injury. Yeah, no, you're being smart. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. Forgive me, Elder Seed Seer, but this appears to be urgent. Oh, he's got, like, a call coming in. What? Again? Gleipnir has struck once more in the North Shroud. The whalers came too late to see the beast themselves, but the man it attacked yet lives. They're bringing him to Falgord Float as we speak. Kane Sena. Then we must meet him there. Will you accompany us, Kakushu? Aethelmere should be able to apprise us of the details upon our arrival. Let's do it. Ah, here we are. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. Word of the attack has yet to spread among the populace. They remain calm for now. Kane Sena? We cannot say for certain Gleipnir has quit this place. Stay on your guard. Oh, maybe we'll see it this early. Aethelmere. Elder Seedseer, you honor us with your presence. I cannot thank you enough for coming all this way. Kane Sena. Given the dire circumstances, I would not leave this to another. Where is that wounded man? Outside of the bobbing cork, being attended to by one of our hearers. He's a capable healer, but I worry this is beyond his abilities. I shall do all in my power to aid him. I, in turn, may have need of assistance as well. I ask that you stay close, both of you. Both me and... Oh yeah, I wasn't sure if Aethelmere was coming, but no, he's not. Afflicted man. Ugh. Yeah, you got magic blasphemy poison inside you, friend. Kane Sena. He clings to life, albeit barely. We must try to ease his pain. Euthanasia, a bold move for Kane Sena. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. That he survived this encounter with Gleipnir speaks to his fortitude. I know not if he can be saved, but if we can at least delay his suffering, we must. A agreed. Falgord for Hearer. He's a hardy soul, but I'm utterly at a loss. While I manage to heal his wounds, the poison lingers. I fear the worst is yet to come. When I removed his clothes for treatment, I recognized the chains. If this is indeed the creeping death. Kanesana, do not lose heart. I shall spare no effort. Rest for now. We may have need of your talents again ere long. I literally thought that was uh, a Merrick coming up to be, but no, that's just a player dressed like a Merrick. Chigos, man, a Chigos, a bloody swarm of them. Those are like the, the, the gross uh, fly gnat things, right? It came from the East Gate. Chigos are known, Falgord here, Chigos are known carriers of the creeping death. The villagers are on edge. If they think the vile can harbingers of another plague, they may panic. Kanisana, pray, see the Chigos. I shall remain here with the victims. I shall go to the Chigos. Falgord, floor, Falgord hero. We cannot let the Chigos enter the village. Rumor of sickness has already begun to spread, and a swarm will surely sow terror and discord. Understandably. Afflicted man. Uh, yes, yeah, still groaning. Kane Sena. I shall do everything in my power to save this man. 
I entrust the matter of the Chigos to you, so stop stalling for time, Coldrun. Or Kakushu. Whatever your name is. Keeper of the Entwined Serpent. I think this wild-eyed fellow is the source of the earlier yelling. Do you see any Chigos nearby? Borland. Cheer goes where? Keep them away from me. Panicky man. They were near Alder Springs. A whole swarm of them, like an army, getting ready for war. Bringing the creep and death like as not. Folk have been dropping dead with no rhyme or reason. I'm not about to join them. No, sir. Came running back fast as my legs could carry me. Borland. Were you bitten? I will show you to a hearer if so. Panicky man. Not a single hole that doesn't belong. <laughs> That's a good way to put it. You can be sure. You best do something about that swarm, though. Borland. Would that we could, but keeping the gate manned is our priority. We have not the numbers to spare for a hunting party. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. By the time the whaler reinforcements arrive, it may be too late. We'll deal with the Chigos. The one who culls the greater numbers owes the other a flagon of ale, aye? Sounds good. Borland. I commend your bravery. Godspeed, and don't get bitten. I will try not to, but I'm a tank. I'm kind of right in their faces. Oh, to be a red mage. Oh, yep, here they are. No problem at all. Hurst Mill Merchant. Hopefully you are not bitten by any of the gross things. Twelve be praised, and you! I've come bearing a cure for the creeping death, but it's of little use against actual death. You have a cure for it? Oh, right, because it's something that it's already cured. Aye, that's why I've come. I'd heard tell of a man suffering from uncommon pains at Falgord Float. Sensed an opportunity to philan philanthropy with a touch of profit, I'll admit. But if what you say is true, his condition demands a much swifter pair of feet than mine. Could you bring the medicine to him in my stead? No need for payment this time, of course. I don't think this is going to work. I think this is not the actual creeping death. This is magic creeping death. You saved my life, and one good turn deserves another. I only hope the cure works as well as purported. As for me, I'll be on my way, and give any vile can I spy a wide berth. Well, thank you for your philanthropy, as much as I don't think it will actually help. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. To think that the mere mention of Chigos could spark such a panic. The creeping death casts a long shadow over these lands. The Hearer. You've brought medicine. What luck! We must administer it straight away. I Again, you are optimistic. Uh, what? Well, wrong person. Kane Sena. Thank you for calling the Chigos. Alas, our patient's condition has yet to improve, and it's all we can do to keep him from succumbing to the poison. Creeping Death Remedy, a medicine made from the Glim Shroom, which cures the Creeping Death. Hmm. I know this medicine. It was once used to treat the Creeping Death. Given his symptoms, it may well prove effective here as well. I mean, it certainly can't hurt. I don't blame them for trying. I just, I'd be surprised if this works. Kane Sena, it works upon the body quite quickly, as I recall. Uh, I... <clears throat> Kane Sena, hold on just a while longer, my friend. The medicine will soon relieve your pain. That's... Yeah, I... Afflicted man, I... I don't... It hurts! It hurts! Ah. Why? Why? I... Ah, oh, pain. Ah, oh, this poor guy. The man's shrieks die in his throat as his body is racked by violent convulsions. He then falls still and quiet as if his breath was snatched from his chest. Oh, boy. As someone beloved once said, no one should die in pain. Kane Sena, Twelve, have mercy. At the very least, his suffering is over. Keeper of the Entwined Serpent. Had we been quicker to deliver the medicine, would he have yet lived? No, no, he would not have. Kane Sena. Nay, I think not. He was doomed from the moment the poison entered his blood, as will be others if we do not soon gain an understanding of our foe. Let this tragedy not be in vain, but serve as a lesson. Though the effects of Gleipnir's corruption resemble the creeping death, it is clear the two share little else in common. 
The poison burns through the body more quickly than any disease. Too deadly is it, is it to be borne by creatures so fragile as Chigos or any other besides. Yeah, so the Chigos were unrelated. I, I thought for a second that maybe Gleipnir was, like, using the Chigos as a vector, but, but no. Falgord here. And that is one possibility the people... One less possibility the people need fear. Tis a shame a life was lost, but this knowledge may help us ensure that others are not. Kanesena. Spread word, but do so with delicacy. In these troubled times, fear and despair can drive even the goodliest of souls to desperate ends. Gleipnir is the only blasphemy known to us in Gridania. For now, we must do our utmost to stop him from sowing further discord. Falgord here. Understood, Elder Seeds here. I'll give this man a proper burial before sharing what we've discovered. I love the conjurer hats, just the straight up kind of white wizard hats. A little prayer for him. Ascertaining Gleipnir's whereabouts is still a primary concern. Let us return to the Adder's Nest, for information should surely be our most reliable weapon in the days ahead, and there is no better place to acquire it. And I'll bet in whatever final fight awaits us against that blasphemy, who we still haven't seen yet, and which is not normal, which is not abnormal for the first quest, I'll bet that Kanesen is going to be our healer. Keeper of the Serpent. Glaikneer has been sighted in various locales, and though we are reviewing every report, we suspect most are erroneous. Thayer has a way of making one jump at shadows. It will take some time before we have determined which reports merit a more involved dis investigation. Until then, I ask that you to stay vigilant and keep your eyes peeled for any sign of the blasphemy. Shrouded in peril complete. Alright, next quest to give voice. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents is eager to resume the hunt. I, it's weird. I'm, I like the, I'm interested where this quest is going, but it feels like the least reliant so far on old content, on old characters and old stuff, just because, that compared to the other ones, because the Twelves, because Kane Sen is not particularly dear to, to particularly dear to me. I wasn't familiar with this, so it feels almost like a new thing rather than the wrapping up of an ongoing arc. I wonder if that's the if it feels that way for people who who started in Gridania. We have followed up on every report concerning Gleipnir, even those that beggared belief. The most promising suggests the blasphemy is currently stalking the South Shroud. We're to proceed there at once, for there's no telling when it might strike again. The Elder Seed Seer is already en route to Roots Lake. Let us not keep her waiting. Let's go. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. No sign of the beast yet, thankfully. A glimpse, single glimpse of Gleipnir might send people running. We'd be, we would be hard-pressed to restore order. I'm imagining Gleipnir is like a wolf creature, but I, I don't know. Kane Sena. Greetings, Kukushu. As luck would have it, my sister Raya, oh, frequents Camp Tranquil. I remember that from the White Mage questline. We would do well to meet with her first, for she may have knowledge of this threat that can aid in our search. Hello, cat. Kane-sena. It has been too long, Raya-o. Raya-o-sena. Kane! I was afraid the situation might force your arrival. Would that this reunion were under more joyous circumstances. It's heartening to see her joined by the bearer of Atoa's will. Ah! We get a little piece of dialogue from, um, the specific to someone who completed the White Mage questline. Unfortunately, Gleipnir's poison cannot be cured by any healing force known to us, as I'm sure you have already learned. Nevertheless, I have faith that together we will find a way to defeat it. Kane Sena. Every moment is crucial, so let us dispense with further pleasantries. Have we have you received word of Gleipnir's whereabouts? Raya O. Oh. I have. It recently ambushed a poor traveler, who succumbed to his wound soon thereafter. A tragic and increasingly common tale. No others in Camp Tranquil have come to harm, but some claim they feel a presence of the, in the distant trees, staring at them with a malicious intensity. 
they struggle to find the courage to venture beyond the safety of the camp. Some of these blasphemies feel like jobs for the SCP Foundation. Connie Senna. While its victims exhibit symptoms reminiscent of the creeping death, Glaipnir's corruption seems to only affect those who have been assaulted by the blasphemy itself. Yeah, that's a that's a, a small a small thing to be grateful for, that it's not contagious in that way. Beyond him spreading it, or beyond uh, Glaipnir spreading it. Kane, we have yet to confirm a single instance of it spreading from one individual to another. Raya, oh. That's somewhat reassuring, but it will provide little comfort to the people here, I think. If Gleipnir comes, any defense we mount will come at great cost. Those who fall wounded will invariably die. I'm at a loss. The people under my care may can see it. They grow tense and bicker amongst themselves. Some even accuse me of ad I standing idly by while this monster roams free. As if I'm not doing all that I can. Yeah, that's frustrating. Kane. I apologize. Would that I had come to you sooner. Would that there were more I could offer you. Not every burden is yours to bear, Kane. That's true, but let's go with maybe the elementals could help. That's a good idea. I mean, probably won't work, but maybe. Raya O. The elementals cry out for succor as loudly as the people do. This I know you feel, Kane. Gleipnir poses a threat to all life in the Twelve's Wood, and as such, we should face it as one. Yeah, so maybe they can help us track it down or something. Kane, their strength has waned since the calamity, and I am reluctant to impose upon them. Nay, as seed seers, it is our duty to first expend every option available to us and spare them further distress. I don't know, this feels like a break glass in case of emergency type deal. Once we have laid low the blasphemy, the elementals will be at peace. I'm with Raya O on this one, not Kane. Raya O, well then. How do you propose we go about that? Kane, first allow me to speak with the people here and assure them that all will be well, that Gradania's resolve to weather this storm remains steadfast. I guess, I just, I, I think they're going to see it as empty words. Raya O, no road is closed to the true of heart. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised that you'd begin with an earnest and heartfelt appeal. For my part, I'll reach out to Arun. Perhaps, to, isn't Arun, like, with the Ishgardian uh, delegation? Uh, not the Ishgardian delegation, with the... Oh, I can't remember. The the group that went up to Garlemald. Isn't he with them? I guess they're split up now. Perhaps together we can find a way to offer similar comfort to the Elementals. I have no doubt we will require their assistance in the days ahead. I guess I just assumed Arun was still in Garlemald, like, doing aftercare, that sort of thing. Thank you, sister. May the Twelve watch over and keep you both. May I trouble you to accompany me? The presence of a storied hero would surely lend credence to my claims that the people's difficulties will soon be at an end. Don't use my credibility for your lies. Keeper of the Entwined Serpent, while you intend to that, I shall gather what information I can from the Wood Whalers stationed here. Pray look for me at the camp proper when you have finished. Though I know that even now, that even if it isn't exactly true that all will be well, and we, can assure, we can't we can assure anyone of that, um, it's nice for them to see that, like, the most powerful person in Gridania is here making an effort, and, like, I, and that sort of thing matters these days. Like, you know, despair can turn you into a fiend, so it literally matters. Khan, Kane. If we are to convince the people that they need not live in fear of Gleipnir, then my words alone may be insufficient. I do not comport myself as an imposing figure blessed with martial prowess, to say the least. You, on the other hand, are renowned as a peerless warrior who has triumphed in countless trials. Simply looking on your features fills me with confidence that this crisis too shall pass. I pray you stay by my side, that those we speak with might be joyed in your presence. Okay. Let's go show off my beautiful face. Try as they might to go about their lives as normal, there is an unmistakable tension as in, in their every movement. What we must do, what we can, to put their minds at ease. We'll start with Inflamed Man.
Seatseers are sitting pretty with their guards and finery. What do they care for beasties running amok? They'll be fine. Uh, that's why they're doing nothing while it hunts us. We'd be fools to trust our lives to those that don't care a whit. Aye, past time we went south. At least in Oldar, they don't pretend to look out for the common man. Uh, hello. Ah, uh, Elder Seedseer, I was just shitting on you. Kanesena, I promise you that we are sparing no effort in our hunt for Gleipnir. However, it will take time, and more may suffer before the beast is laid low. Good, so she is, she's not promising the moon. She's not saying all will be well in a short-term sense. She's just saying in the long run, we'll do our best. Nevertheless, I ask you to place your faith in me, if only for a while longer. I love the Twelves, would enter people with all my heart. I will not let our enemy torment us forever. I, I understand. Man's got to give voice to his worries from time to time, I. Nothing I want less than to abandon my home. I'll stick around. For now. Nice job, Connie. Sorry about earlier. I've been strung tighter than a longbow lately. I really do appreciate the seed seers and all they've done for us. I pray they can deliver us from evil. Alright, who's person number two? Is distraught woman. A single scratch is enough to spell one's doom, they say. Nothing but to wait for death to come. How could we face a beast like that? Kane, do not give in to despair, my friend. Know that I shall do all in my power to see us through this crisis. Hold fast to hope and encourage others to do as well. I'll try, Elder Seedseer. I know you've placed yourself at risk leaving the safety of the city and coming here, and that means a lot to me and mine. I'll stay close to the whalers and pray news of your triumph reaches us soon. I like your hair, distraught woman. Thank you. I promise it will not be long. Everyone's scared, but as long as we stick together and stay strong, I think we'll survive. Uh, some of us will survive. I haven't repaired gear in a while. But this is not the time for it. Restive man. Restive and restless are, are mean the same thing, right? I saw it! A gigant or gargantuan beast stalking the woods with horns the size of my leg! What's to stop it from coming here to fill its belly? Gleipnir will do no such thing, I swear. I shall see to it personally that the blasphemy does not come within a malm of this village. Keep heart, for brighter days lie ahead of us. Uh, truly, Elder Seedseer. Uh, perhaps I let my imagination get the better of me. You're a beacon in these dark times. I pray you restore the peace soon. I shall, you can be certain. Kanisena is probably... No, she's 100% my least favorite city leader. She's not bad or annoying, she just feels like the least interesting of the group. We can cower in fear, or we can strive to lift one another's, one another's flagging spirits. Better to choose the latter. May the matron bring you victory for all of our sakes. And last, but certainly not least, is Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. Though we're not here to comfort him. Will that be all for now, Elder Seeds here? It will. I have done what I can to quell the unrest, but so long as Gleipnir lives, they'll never be at peace. Just sometimes simply lending an ear does wonders, as must be the case for elementals, yes? Do you get your chosen course? I want to really push the elemental idea. Indeed, you are correct. Today was a welcome reminder of that truth and an important step in our journey. Mayhap I should visit these settlements more often. Doubtless some here think me as distant as the elementals, so rarely do they see me in the outer reaches. It's a good idea. You have served me admirably as a protector thus far, for which I am grateful. Yet until we have found and laid Glape near low, I must continue to oppose it and impose upon your goodwill. There's no imposition, Elder Seedseer. You saved me on the killing fields of Cartano. My life is yours now and always. Oh, I didn't know that. Has this guy been a thing? Like, is this guy like the Raubon of of Gridania? Is he like a major deal for people who've done the Gridanian starting stuff? Your life is your own to command, but I thank you for your words. 
and your conviction, which fills me with confidence that the path we walk is true. Even if that path takes us far afield. Huh, did I ever tell you, when I was a young student, I would often steal into the woods with a dear friend of mine, much to the chagrin of our teacher. Uh, no? Deep down, I suspect there is still a part of me that yearns to wander where I should not. Uh, that feels like a callback to something 1.0-ish. I don't know. Or it feels like a callback to something I'm not familiar with. Uh-oh. Gleipnir sighting, it sounds like. Landonel. Elder Seed Seer. Word from the border. We got ourselves a right bloody mess by the sound of it. What has happened? Per your earlier instructions, the Woylers closed the roads to all travel while we scoured the woods for sign of Gleipnir, but... Now a group of locals are demanding to be led into further into Thanalan. They're terrified by the sound of it, screaming about the creeping death and God knows what else. Despair grips their heart. Ah, oh, shit. We're going to have to put down some blasphemies even before we see Grape the Gleipnir, aren't we? If it consumes them wholly, then we may have yet more blasphemies to contend with. I will speak with them. Wild rumors fuel their panic, and with truth and compassion will I convince them to see reason and return to their homes. There's like a 0% chance she's going to convince them to see reason and return to their homes. If anyone can, it's you, Elder Seeds here. We're doing our best to keep them calm for now, but my man's words painted a grim picture. I pray you make your way to the border as quickly as you can. Kane. The people here are indeed terrified. I must take care with my words. I don't... I mean, your... Your words are good, but I'm... I have doubts at the moment. Your words are okay. Keeper. It's good we arrived when we did. Any later and we might have been met with a bloodier sight. Like, you think they're going to attack the Wood Whalers? We're going through whether you like it or not. Oh, I guess they are. Unnerved man. Let us through, damn you. We're standing here while the creeping death nips at our heels. You're telling us to die. <laughs> Woodwhaler. Those rumors are false. The elder seed seer herself sent word that the creeping death is not responsible for the recent incidents. You mustn't surrender to panic. Return to your homes while we deal with the threat. Pay no heed to baseless stories. I don't blame... I mean, from the way it sounds, I don't blame the... I don't blame the panickers. Stories? Stories? I've seen the dead with my own eyes. Don't tell me what, I've, what is and isn't true. Rebel, rebel, rebel. Kane, hearken to me, friends. I come before you now to assure you that the creeping death has not returned. Only those who have been wounded by Gleipnir are in danger, and so I beseech you, take shelter in your homes until the threat is past. Unnerved man. Gleipnir? The beast I saw in the wood? We have to run! It could have followed us! Oh. You saw him? Yeah, a keeper. You saw him where? Not far from here. Those glistening horns, those terrible chains, reaching out to drag you down to the seventh hell. We ran and ran and never looked back. Wow. You must be fast runners to outrun that thing. Assume I'm assuming it's fast. Maybe it's just like, uh, like one of those palace cats where... It's deadly, but it really can't run on its stubby little legs that far. But don't worry, it didn't catch any of us. No one's marked, you see? that We're safe. That means we're safe, right? Oh, crap. Nope. Alarmed man, but uh, say we weren't quite fast enough. What then? Uh, you're going to have a painful death, my friend. Kane Sena. Its horns and claws are where the poison resides. Even a scratch would be a cause for concern. Oh, oh, we got. Are we getting Gleipnir vision? No, we're getting dizzy poison man vision. Unless the despair gets it, like, because he might just be like, oh, I mean, I guess the best cure for the poison is to turn into a, a fiend first. 
even a little scratch. Then is this too late for me? Is that why my body feels like it's on fire? Oh, this is fast working poison, Jesus. Unnerved man. You you told me the branches tripped you up. You said that's how it happened. You you said. Yeah, but you thought it was contagious. You thought you were gonna Actually I guess if when back when he thought he was contagious, that probably makes it worse that he hid the truth. Kane Sena. Oh heavenly winds, guide us something something. I I don't feel any better. Do it again, do it again. Oh crap. It's yep. It's not happening. It hurts. Help me. The country has no effect. There can be no no mistake. This is Gleipnir's doing. For someone who's a healer, it's got to suck to find something that you can't heal. That just doesn't. You, you got to feel like useless. Even so, I ask that you not lose heart. Stay strong, for if we surrender to fear, the beast is already won. I... I guess, but I don't think that's it. No, I, I don't want to die. Please, help me. He's not contagious. It's okay. Ah! Oh, well, he's turning into a despair beast is contagious. Yeah, he turned into the monkey things. Keeper, get back! That's a cool one. I am a fan of this one. You said it wasn't... What? Why? Why? No, that's not the... That's not Gleipnir. Uh, yeah, here we go. Liars. Liars, all of you. None of us are safe. None of us... Ah! Double monkey, or are you going to turn into something different? Yep, double monkey. Despair made manifest. Twelve for Fend. Is there not that can be done for these poor souls? I, there is, but I'm afraid the the cure is on my back, and it's pretty sharp. Not but one thing. I know. I know. We must lay them to rest. Contain the threat. Secure it. Protect it. <sighs> and this is, I mean, it... It's always rough to see them have to kill not just someone, but their own people. Like, I mean, we saw that with uh, with the, what's his name, the Dragon Satrop. Um, I can't, I don't remember his name, Vray something. Um, but we saw that with him when he had to kill his own people, just how much it hurt. Yes, yeah, so they went down pretty quick, but that is rough. Wood Whaler. We did what we had to. If we had let the fiends live, the blood of many would have been on our hands. I think you are... I know you absolutely did the right thing, Wood Whaler. Indignant woman. I can't take it. What kind of life is this, waiting to be hunted or turned into one of them? Upset man. Matron, have mercy. What were those fiends? The creeping death seems a mercy compared to an end like that. Yes, seriously. I don't even know what the creeping death feels like, but it's got to be... I don't know. What they went through turning into that despair thing and not having to deal with whatever an afterlife is seems better than the the torment of that, that the dude in the first quest went through. Quest went through. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. It was not the poison which triggered their transformation, but despair. Overwhelming despair. Kane, they are at peace. Whether it had not come to this, I was powerless to prevent it. You did all you could, Elder Seedseer. Upset man. Is that what's going to happen to us? Is there no hope? What you witnessed was the fate of those who fall to deepest despair. It feeds upon grief and anguish, and is more deadly than Gleipnir itself. But as I swore to you that we shall defeat the blasphemy that haunts our homeland, so too do I swear that despair will not be the end of us. Keep the faith, and look to the horizon, for brighter days will come. Upset man. As you say, Elder Seedseer, as you say. 
Leipnir is not here, and so you are free to return to your homes, but I urge you to take care on the path back. We will, Elder Seedseer. Uh, that I'm sure of. I'm sure they will be careful. The storm has passed, but a darker tempest rolls in the distance. So long as the specter of despair looms, the people will struggle to take any words of comfort to heart. We will see more tragedies like this. The elementals, too, cry out for a solution. The longer we struggle to resolve the crisis, the more innocent lives we put at risk. Raya O oh said we would need to turn to the elementals for assistance, and I know now she was right. Yeah, damn right she was right. And so I will seek an audience with the Great One. Who's the Great One? However, there are preparations I must attend to first. I shall make the proper, proper ablutions at Lotus Stand. Pray return to the Adder's Nest and await my summons. Keeper of the Entwined Serpents. Despite our best efforts, we have been unable to prevent further loss of life. I foresee even greater hardship ahead. As we strive to press on, we mustn't forget the words of the Elder Seed Seer. We must strive to remain undaunted in the face of despair. She is preparing for her communion with the Great One. When the time is right, she will call upon us both. Until then, my friend, stay strong. I will stay strong. Bop, 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 bop. I will also stay uh, logged off because that's all the time I have for today. Thank you for watching. We will continue with the quest line next time. See you later. Bye-bye.